Hello and welcome to ZimWatch TV. We are thrilled to have you join our community of news enthusiasts. If you're looking for the latest news, updates, and insights, you're in the right place. Subscribe to our channel, hit the notification bell, and like our videos to stay updated on all our latest content. Charlton Wendy calls for collective action against Manungugwa's regime. Prominent opposition figure Charlton Hwendi has called for collective action from citizens to fight against President Emerson Manungugwa's regime, saying that one person alone cannot bring about change. In a post on X, Hwendi said, Regime enablers on X are quick to label people sellouts. We differed because you think one person can remove ZANU PF. To remove this regime, you need unity of genuine comrades. Wendy's comments come as the government continues to crack down on opposition activists, with several arrests and detentions in recent weeks. He highlighted the case of Job Sikala and Jacob Ngarif Humi, who are facing arrest, saying, Police today want to arrest Job Sikala and Jacob Ngarif Humi, the same people you called sellouts. Wendy's call for collective action is a rallying cry for citizens to come together and fight against the regime's authoritarianism and human rights abuses. He emphasized the need for unity among opposition forces, saying, we need to put aside our differences and work together to remove this regime. The government's crackdown on opposition activists has been widely condemned by human rights groups and international organizations. Wendy's call for collective action is seen as a response to the government's attempts to silence dissenting voices. As one opposition supporter said, we cannot allow the government to continue its repression of our rights and freedoms. We must come together and fight for our future. Huindi's post has sparked a lively debate on social media, with many calling for unity and collective action against the regime. Others have criticized the government's crackdown on opposition activists, saying it is a sign of weakness and desperation. The situation in Zimbabwe continues to deteriorate, with the economy in crisis and human rights abuses on the rise. Wendy's call for collective action is seen as a beacon of hope for citizens who are desperate for change.